So I was thinking the other day, as I was normally doing, while thinking about safety and well-being on the Toaster Space Program. We have planes. I have a lander. We have to get ourselves into space as efficiently as possible. Well, why not use a plane? We can use the plane to get the lander up into space where it can board a rocket I've already sent up there. And as you can see, I am an expert at building planes that also double, by the way, as submersibles. Now, under most conditions, this would have worked. What I have here is a highly specialized piece of equipment known as, quite simply, the boat. What? The boat is a powerhouse. Its four engines provide loads of thrust into the air, and I think that this could be used to raise the lander up to space altitude if we had to. The new Land Boat Mark IV now has a coupler on the top, designed for grabbing onto anything that comes its way. All we have to do is get the Land Boat somewhere where we can successfully board it. So we will exit the runway here and head over to the... whatever that is. Now that we have retrofitted the lander with a brand new... Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus, I forgot how to fly this thing! Hold on. Now that we've managed to retrofit a coupler to the bottom of the lander, we should have no issues getting this thing on board. Shite. Okay. No, 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 no! Now that we've retrofitted a fucking coupler, get the fuck out. There we go. Is that so hard? Now, all I have to do is successfully land it over there. Preferably. Maybe I should have considered bringing the boat a little closer to the launch pad. Maybe I should have considered using jet engines to power the damn thing while it was in atmosphere. That way. That way! You stupid piece of equipment, go! Oh my dear Christ. Well now. <sighs> Not the world's most useful, is it? Oh dear God! I have decided to retrofit the lander with propellers because I thought that might work a little bit better. Now it would really help if all four propellers had turned on. All we have to do is get this fucking thing over to the goddamn lander. How hard is that? All right, let's try this again. Gentle. It's like flying a fucking drone, this thing. Only a really shitty one. All right, we just gotta line this thing up is all. It shouldn't be hard. We're not wasting any fuel. All we're draining is the electricity, which can be recharged with the solar panels. I think. All right, we're almost there. We are almost there. Keep going that way. Target is set. The landing. Oh god, the pod isn't even open. This is gonna be very interesting. Careful. 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 Okay, off the ground. Forwards. Careful. We have to rotate slightly this way. Slightly that way. Forwards. Ah! Oh, motherfucker! We've destroyed a thing! Shit, shit! Right, seeing as how there are a few minor flaws with this equipment, I am going to have to add a few more things to make it work. Now that we've accomplished all these tasks and more, we are actually ready to begin.
Right. We have a minor issue. We have now greatly improved the capabilities of our lander, as it is now capable of taking off normally, I hope. All we have to do is wait for the engines to get more thrust. Any second now. After careful consideration and thought, I have reverted to our original engine design. Which should have no issue getting us up to snuff. Up! Go up! There are now six engines, giving us significantly more control and hopefully lift in the first place. Oh Christ, this is not working the way it was supposed to! Fuck it, we're using jets. This is supposed to be making more fucking thrust than this. This is my best idea yet. Let's get our asses off the ground and get going. Full speed. Oh, that is better. That is much better. We are off the ground. We are rolling. That's right, boy. We're docking today. We're docking tomorrow. We're doing this the old-fashioned way. We drag it. And now we have to gently, ever so gently, line it up. First we must hover. Then we must dock. All of this must be done. Or else. Why? Where? Oh shit, oh shit. Oh motherfucker, that counts. I think that counts. Nope, 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 no, no, you don't. Motherfucker! Shit, 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 shit. What the fuck? 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 No, 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 no. 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 Here's a fucking idea. How about we put some fucking wheels on the damn thing and just roll it over? That make it easier? Yes. Good. Good enough. Fuck you, we're rolling. Nope, 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 nope. Back on your wheels. Back on your fucking wheels. This is how we're gonna fucking get there. Shut the fuck up. Now, technically, we got somewhere. Safety is our number one concern here at the Toaster Space Program. Now that we have multiple wheels, we are going to- Oh, motherfucker. God f uh, Look, I don't care if it doesn't look that good. Shut the fuck up and get us there. Steerable wheels probably would have been an important decision to make earlier on. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're almost there! Very gently, we go down the wheel. The wheels retract, and we are but a normal plane again. We begin our docking procedure. First, we must take off. We must begin hovering, simply and very cautiously, next to the machine. Once we are hovering next to the machine, we will automatically, by means of computer, Rotate the machine around, such that we can figure out what the fuck we are doing. All we have to do is tell the computer to target the target and it will send us flying everywhere that we don't want to go. And risk the whole mission by the whole thing turning upside down and exploding. Again. Fucking. What does it take to get this fucking thing docked? Now that the lander is face to face with the boat, we will be able to get it to sign. All we have to do is retract the gear. We very slowly rise up off the ground and retract the landing gear. While we do this, we will rotate the craft ever so slightly to the right. Using very precise maneuvers, we will bump into the other craft and go directly over the top of it. 
Because fucking you, fucking Christ, this is impossible. How the fuck are you supposed to dock a craft when you're in fucking... Fuck this. Fuck it. Fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. <laughs> 